Nadie me amará como me amas tú Nada puedo hacer que te pueda defraudar a ti Jesús Mis logros los entrego ante la cruz Nadie me amará como me amas tú
622, the Lord said to Moses, tell Aaron and his sons, this is how you are to bless the Israelites. Say to them, the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face toward you and give you peace. So they will put my name on the Israelites and I will bless them. Tonight we speak the blessing of Almighty God over you, your church, your city, your family, your children, and their children, and their children for a thousand generations in the name that is above every other name, the name of Jesus. Amen. The Lord bless you and keep you. Make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face toward you and give you peace. Oh. Stay. 
things are changing in a world where things are one moment to the next just bumping us hitting us storms and waves it may feel like that for your life I don't know where you stand today but I know that God is the same and it's good to remember that and it's good to practice that that no matter what happens in this world today we can say and declare that you've been the same God back then you're the same today so we're gonna declare that with everything today you're the same God Calling on the God of Jacob, whose love endures through generations. I know that you will keep your covenant. I'm calling on the God of
Jesus, you're, Jesus, you're the same yesterday and today and forever. I believe this, I believe this. You freed the captives and you're freeing hearts right now. You are the same God. You are the same God. You touch the lepers and I feel your touch right now. You are the same God. You are the same God. You're the same forever. you to do stuff like bless us and guide us and lead us, but we want to give you our worship today and open up our mouths and give you our praise. I thank you, Lord, that you're, you're not going to be more worthy next week or in a couple weeks than you are right now. This is Christmas right here. 
You, you inhabit the praises of your people. So, Lord, I want to ask you to do something, and I know you'll know what I mean, even if it sounds confusing. Be born in this moment in our hearts. Be born this moment in our hearts. May our praise give birth to faith, our faith give way to grace, and you receive all the glory. This is our prayer in Jesus' name. Amen. Come on, give God a great praise. Thank you, Lord. I love it. 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 I want to welcome you today to church. I want to welcome you into God's presence. Actually, that's a dumb thing to say. It's not like you just came into God's presence. He's been with you all week. Yeah. So we're here to worship Him and, and praise Him. And I was so excited. This song, this song that we just sang called Same God, I don't know if you noticed, I snuck a new verse in there. Did y'all notice it? Y'all don't care at all, do you? Like, we didn't even know the old verses. We don't care. But yeah, we put Mary in there. I'm calling on the God of Mary, whose favor rests upon the lowly. And then we can say what Mary said, for with you, nothing is impossible. Amen. Amen. I see you. We, uh, we wrote that song, and we put Moses and David and Jacob and all of those people. We even put the Holy Spirit in there. And Abby said, why is there no woman in the song? And she wouldn't let it go. We, you know, I took that girl, and I took my mom and Holly and Abby to Handel's Messiah the other night. But Abby, even on the way to the show, she was asking me why I didn't put a woman in the song, Same God. Just this insatiable critic over here. This, and I said, I couldn't figure out how to do it. And then it came to me, that verse came to me while I was preparing my sermon for today. So I said, Chris, do it. John Sal, don't forget the words. We'll, and if we can, we'll put it on the recording because we just got the mixes back, and I think we can get it in time for the album. So we'll see. I don't know. I liked it. I told Abby, I hope you liked your verse. Merry Christmas. You're not getting any shoes just to worship song verse. But welcome, welcome. Um, I want to pray one more time before I preach. I want